Hey guys, it's Ninja Mom here, and I am here with a closet full of wax haul. You guys know that I bought, I use, I've always loved closet full of wax. Um, I have been buying from her since I got into the wax community. Um, I just buy hit or miss just every now and then, and I always buy, always buy whenever she has her eight ounce bag sales or anything like that. So she has a sale recently with eight ounce bags. I have not opened the box yet. We're going to do that now. I'm super excited. She always, um, it's been since summertime since I've ordered from a closet full of wax, but she's always been very big on sending lots of samples in her orders. That's what I love, love, love about her. Um, at this time, her eight ounce bags were $6.75 a piece, you guys. $6.75 a piece. Like, killer, killer deal. Let me hide my address. See? $6.75 a piece. Love when she has these deals. So I bought six of them. And you open it up, and it's very well wrapped. You can already see the samples on top. She sends so many samples. So let's dive into what sample she sent. There's how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven samples right off the top. Eleven samples, you guys. Right off the top. These are all extra samples that she sent. So she sent Dragon Blood Bourbon Butterscotch, and it's in a cute little ghost. Whew. The Dragon Blood is very much there, and the bourbon and butterscotch is really nice, but I'm not positive if I'm going to be like, yay, and burn that one. This looks to be maybe a scoopable, or it's just a scent cup, we'll see. But this is in bum bum cream type. Let's see if it is a scoop or just a, sh okay, it's not, no, it's not a scoop. Ooh, I love that. It does smell exactly like the Brazilian bum bum cream. Ooh, girlfriend, take it to the house. I'm gonna be getting more of this. I love this cream, I buy this cream all the time. And now that I know that I can get wax in that scent, your girl gonna be doing that. I have a Marshmallow Fireside from Bath and Body Works, another, like Bath and Body Works type, another little scent cup right here. And these are one ounce cups, you guys. Mmm, that's gonna be, yeah, that's good. I love Marshmallow Fireside. Should I be describing these to you guys? Marshmallow Fireside literally smells, this one smells just like the Bath & Body Works Marshmallow Fireside, a very smoky, sweet marshmallow scent. The Bum Bum Cream is a very, oh, it's a sweet, mm, it's, a, I, it's just a very sweet, lightly floral, pretty scent. That's the only way I can describe it. The Dragon's Blood and Bourbon Butterscotch, um, it smells like a liquored butterscotch. And it smells like um, dragon's blood, like an incense. The bourbon butterscotch actually might save that one for me now that I just smelled it again. Let them eat cake type Tokyo scent type sugared violets, cashmere cream, bath and body works type, and Bartlett pear. That is a mouthful. And it is a purple scent shot. This one I don't really smell, so let's see if I can pop the cup. For all that, I actually like it. It's very pretty. Um, I think what I'm smelling is the cashmere cream and the sugared violets in this. It smells very nice. It's like a light, very sweet floral. Um, it's not like pungent in your face floral. It's a nice, calm, sweet floral. This one is orange creamsicle cupcake hostess type with tea and cakes. And it is in one of these fun little bars that she does. It's like a piece of one. Oh, that is heavenly. 
Uh, orange cream cupcake blends very well with tea and cakes. I could see myself getting more of this. We'll have to see how it performs on warm. Rick Grimes. Oh my gosh. The Walking Dead. I love this show. Rick Grimes. And his scent is Musk Smoky Palo Santo and Blue Sugar. I don't like Palo Santo. But we'll see. This isn't bad. This is definitely a men's scent. I am picking up that Blue Sugar and the Musk. And just a light Palo Santo. I actually would burn this. Um, I would melt this one. Go Rick. Love it. I love the packaging. Okay, Mexican fried ice cream lemon curd waffle cone cheesecake right here in a cute little square. If you guys have not tried Closet Full of Wax, um, I highly recommend her. And she is she does afterpay. Ooh, that lemon curd. Holy cayole. Mmm, this is like a super yummy lemon cheesecake. This is really, really good. The next one we have is Blackberry, Pinkberry, Tonka Bean, and Marshmallow Clouds Bath and Body Works type. And it's in one of these long little, like, pink Twinkie things. It's pretty. Um, I like the, I like Pinkberry and Tonka Bean a lot. I'm not super into the Marshmallow Clouds scent. Um, I have it in lotion and I don't even use it. Um, but this is sweet. I will try it out. Um, it's nice. Then we have strawberry pound cake bath and body works type and marshmallow clouds bath and body works type. And this is in, it looks like maybe a snowflake. Is it a snowflake? Yes, it is. It's a cute little snowflake. And I smell the strawberry pound cake, but the marshmallow clouds kind of, eh, it kind of does it for me in a bad way. We'll have to see how it plays. I'm not going to judge until I melt. Secret Wonderland bath and body works type. I have this lotion too. And this is an a cute little pizza slice and a doggy bone. You guys probably can't see it that well, sorry. Mmm, that smells good. That smells just like my body lotion. <laughs> and the last sample, but definitely not the least, it is a Biologe Matrix Hair Care Type and Bartlett Pear. That smells like a bottle of pear shampoo. But it smells really good and it's very strong. You can tell that this is um, very, very strong. This might actually be migraine inducing strong for me. So this one might end up getting passed. So those were just the samples you guys from her. Now let's hop into the bags. Whoop, whoop. Okay, so I got Mrs. Claus cookie because we're coming up on Christmas. Mrs. Claus cookie. And I love that it's in snowflakes. Oh, I love it. It's a super sweet, yummy, mm, creamy vanilla cookie. It is so good, and it is really strong, you guys. This is amazing. Mm, 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 mm. And the next one we have is in the squares, and it's Strawberry Shake. I'm kind of anally about strawberry scents. Um, this is a very artificial strawberry. Come <laughs> on, okay. So, uh, you know what? When you go to the bank and some other places, they have those free little candy dishes, and they have those little hard strawberry candies that are wrapped like little strawberries. Um, and they're hard on the outside. They've got that squishy strawberry center, like gooey strawberry center. That's what this smells like, exactly like that. This I'll have to blend with other stuff. I would not melt this by itself. Um, it does smell like a very artificially sugary strawberry candy. Literally like those little strawberry wrapped hard candies. That was strawberry shake. Then we have Tres Leches Cake, which is in these super cute little candy shapes. This one I've got hopes, high hopes for. There's a couple I have high hopes for in here. Mm. Okay, so. This kind of reminds me more of like glazed donut, like a plain glazed, sorry, glazed donut smell. It's good, but it does heavily remind me of a glazed donut. 
It's not bad. Um, I don't smell cinnamon, like a cinnamon or anything. Maybe that's not what it's supposed to be. Um, it does have a, a, a light condensed milk and vanilla scent. A very, very, very faint caramel scent, but it really does remind me of like a fresh glazed donut scent, almost like a Krispy Kreme scent. Then we have almond macaroon, and it's in these bows. Ooh, take it to the house. Okay, whoa, <laughs> that's so strong. These are so strong, you guys. This is a very, very strong cherry type almond. So you'd really have to like that more cherry-ish almond for this. I could see myself mixing this with Mrs. the Mrs. Claus cookies to give it more of that cookie aspect. But this is a very strong cherry almond scent. There's a word for that strawberry shake. Um, it's almost clawingly sweet. The strawberry shake is like clawingly sweet, just to be clear. Then we have toasted coconut donut. And these, this is another one I have a really high hope for. Okay, so it smells good. I hope on warm it it's a little differently. It does smell like coconut. It smells, okay, it does smell like, it does smell like a coconut donut. It has that glazed donut type thing that's going on with the Tres Leches cake, but with a sweet kind of um, toasted coconut. So if I were to say, it does smell like a um, toasted coconut donut. It really does. Super yummy. And the last but not least are these super fun Twinkies, and I love that she picked to make the yellow cream cake, which is the last bag in these because they look like little yellow cake Twinkies. So this is the yellow cream cake and it is, I love it. I hope that's what she was going for when she made this. They look like little individual Twinkies. Mmm. Yum, and this does smell, um, it smells kind of like, um, like a vanilla or white cake mixed with a butter cake. Um, it's got that butter, vanilla, definite cake. No, it's not like a baked cake. It's more like, like the cake batter when you're making a yellow box cake mix. It's very much so that cake batter scent. But I am very pleased with all of these. They are very, very good. Um, I, kind of iffy on the strawberry i'm sure i can uh blend it with something and make it just what i want it to be and if not i'm sure i have plenty of friends that will definitely enjoy it if i can't get it to be all that i think it should be i'm sure that i have plenty of friends that will enjoy it most definitely i love the fact that she sent so many samples so you guys please Head on over to closetfullofwax.com. Check her out. She does have a lot of really good deals. Um, I think she even has a deal going on right now because Halloween is tomorrow. Um, so I hope that you guys enjoy this. And I will be back because a lot of these are going to end up in my empties Tuesday. So I will let you all know how they all worked. I'm very excited to melt all of these. <laughs> I'm not even going to play. Um, they all smell very ready to use. Um, so I'm pumped. I'm going to be using these. Thank you so much. The owner is Michelle and, um, she's such a, she's such a good whiz with wax. She does amazing. We are at 14 minutes. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so sorry. So I hope that you guys try her out. She is really, really good. Um, and please like, share, comment, subscribe down below. Let your girl know how you're doing. And tomorrow is Halloween. So I'm going to wish you guys a happy Halloween the night before. And I hope that you enjoyed this video. Bye.